holy ordinances. <clears throat> so we're here to place the rings on the finger. The ring is a clean uh -huh. circle with no separation point. There's something to think about a ring that's got a perfect circle, no separation point in it. It's just a commitment on your part to always remain together. To never reject one another, as butter suggests an openness to see to see light from one another viewpoint. But the understanding that each of you make a vital contribution to the strength of character of the other. <laughs> now, Jeremy, let this ring and place it on her left hand. represents the groom. This piece of the union cross represents you, Jeremy, and your responsibility to God that you will lead your household and family by his word. By placing this piece of the union cross onto the base, you demonstrate your promise to the bride that you will serve her, love her, and support her for as long as she both shall live. Ephesians 5 25 says, Husbands, love your wives, even as Christ also loved the church and gave himself for it. Now place this in the Right, Caleb. This piece of the unit cross for the fifth year. Placing this piece of the union cross into the, into the Jeremy's cross, the room cross, you demonstrate your promise to the groom that you will serve him, love him, and support him for as long as folks can live. Ephesians 4 2 says, With the lowliness and the meekness, with long suffering and forbearance, one another in love. Okay, that is your position inside. And it comes to one. These three pegs I hold in my hand here of the unity cross represent what will set your marriage apart. These pegs represent God's covenant to you as a married couple. Because of your faith in Him, and you're putting Him at the center of your life and your marriage, He promised to never leave you nor forsake you because of this. His love and His word will be the bedrock 
of your marriage, bonding you together stronger than any trial or difficulty. As you place these three pegs into the cross, I think it's your pegs. the holler now. I think we're done here. 